Um, 7,000 jumps away. Uh, oh, I didn't like plot it, but I can plot it to tell you. I was just going to do the math. No, I'm over here watching a video of my sister. She over here singing this church down too, bro. No, my sister. I'm watching this this video of my sister singing this church down, and she is getting it, bro. Yeah, I'm 190 jumps away. And, that, and that's with Neutron Stars. Um, like what? Yeah, no, I don't really play any of them, them little games on there like that, except for, like, uh, the ones that give me XP for my battle pass. Other than that, I just play, um, uh, Battle Royale, and I'm, I'm trash, so... Okay, let's see, I got Dead by Daylight, Fall Guys, Fortnite, 
Overwatch. Uh, yeah. Overwatch, Among Us, um, Immortal Kombat 11. Yeah. I ain't playing no Mortal Kombat 11 in a fat minute, bro. What? Is it that bad? See, because I've been wondering, because I've been hearing a lot of people say that it's not all that good, so. Well, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you this, uh, just j just my my own little view of of uh, Mortal Kombat is it has not been the same at all. It does not even play like Mortal Kombat. It plays more like DC Universe to me. No, it plays like DC Universe Online. Like, it doesn't even feel like Mortal Kombat anymore. And then... And then there's, like, the fact that, you know, when it, whenever uh, Mortal Kombat vs. DC Universe came out, I beat that game in eight hours. Scorpion Sub Zero and Raiden. I don't know if he could have got Raiden. I don't know about that. You know what killed me in Mortal Kombat 11 was when they killed Sonya off directly. <laughs> that shit had me dead, bro. I was cracking up. And bringing them back since I know, right? I don't know how many times Luke Hang would die. And then what? What really kills me is that they didn't put Kenshi in eleven. That's my dude. I love. I beat somebody's ass with Kenshi.
Right, because because that's what that's what Chronicle was there to to put into play to put into play was the new era. That means that that means no. That means that they need to get into the lore and and, and to be able to understand the shit, just like with any other game. Because don't nobody else start their shit over just so other people can fucking understand. Either you need to get, either need either need, either you need to get with the lore or don't play the game. Shit. I'm not into like DC Universe and all that Marvel, but I didn't know that shit either. I thought it was just a Green Lantern. But that's a person that's not into that stuff, though. You know, as a guy, yeah, I thought it was cool, but, you know, I wasn't a big fan, you know. Cause if you ask me about Sonic, I can I, 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 I tell you everything. about the Transformers that got the Legos but I do want to see, see that though the Legos Transformers I think that shit gonna be dope Season, nigga. You know what I'm tired of seeing? I'm tired of seeing them. I'm tired of seeing them remake horror movies, and they be they be they be fucking trash. <laughs> Y'all seen that movie, The Deliverance, on Netflix? No. With Monique. 
Yeah, that shit was it was good. It was it was based on a true story. It was a B quality movie, but the actors was was like A quality. Nah. Home sweet home. Call me, Why are you gonna call me? Cause I'm from the country. Yeah. Cause I'm gonna tell you what, I seen a spider the other day over here. Me and my homeboy were sitting outside smoking a blunt, homie, and that motherfucker was big. That that spider was as big as the palm of my hand. And I'm talking about just its body, not even with its legs. This shit scared me so bad I farted. <laughs> I'm not even going to lie, bro. What? Dude, for real. It was like, Burr. my friend was like, you fucking nasty. <laughs> Yeah. 